Cap KVU First Alert Weather with Jason Valentine. Aha, uh -huh. good Wednesday evening. We have made it to midweek and quite a lovely day today. Very chilly, yes, but uh, light winds and plenty of sunshine. It's just a beautiful look at our Legend Sky Cam Network as well. We're heading into, well, the evening hours. So we do have a little bit of cloud coverage that has been coming into the northwest in the past couple of hours. And we don't expect shower activity overnight, but as we get into tomorrow, we definitely see some, especially in the evening hours. It looks like it will persist into Friday morning. So more showers are on the way and it could be in the form of rain snow mix. We'll keep an eye, a very close eye on that. Current temperatures we knew today was going to be chilly. Look at these temperatures, lower 40s, mid to upper 30s. And we have another chilly overnight period, though we are going to be warmer than we were last night. And again, the story at the beginning of the week was all of that wind. Well, we still have a couple double digits, but still more or less light winds for our areas. And these winds are going to continue through the weekend, so no real wind events are on the way and looks like after we get through those showers tomorrow into Friday morning we'll be looking much nicer. So let's take a look at that future cast and again more cloud coverage and just little bits of shower activity coming in tomorrow in the late morning to early afternoon but then a very big wall will be coming in as we get into Thursday evening and again pink rain snow mix in blue that is the upper uh, mountains for the Cascades are seeing some snow even some in uh, just to the northeast of Yakima so those showers will persist on and off and again very strange patterns we've seen lately with the rain uh, just extreme scattered showers with some heavy showers at times looks like It'll come to an end as we get to Friday evening, uh, early evening, and then we should have a pretty darn nice evening after that. But unfortunately, we have a, a lunar eclipse, one of the longest ever going on Thursday into Friday, but plenty of clouds are going to be in there. So overnight tonight, we are just right around that freezing mark, 26 for Ellensburg. And again, the good news, we're not seeing any shower activity overnight tonight, but we will see plenty of cloud coverage. As we head into our Thursday evening showers, and again, a chance of seeing sh uh, shower to late morning, early afternoon, tad bit warmer than today, mid to lower 40s, 39 for Ellensburg and these cool conditions are going to be sticking with us. So Friday we are going to be looking at those showers but overnight it'll be warmer with the cloud coverage and those showers so that's good for the Tri-Cities. We'll be in those mid to upper 40s as we head into our next work week and my goodness we are a week and a day away from Thanksgiving. In Yakima overnight for Thursday into Friday we'll be right at that freezing mark so hopefully uh, again, maybe a little bit of rain snow mix could show up mid 40s through Monday and then a little bit warmer overnight lows still right at or below the freezing mark. So folks, we should have a nice morning tomorrow, but then more clouds and showers in your afternoon to early evening.